G'day everyone, Guy from Mad Hat 4 Drive. I'm here today to show you a really cool rooftop tent. Uh, it's called the Southern Cross and it comes in two different sizes. We've got the large on my trailer here and on the top of this trailer over here we've got the extra large. Uh, now you can mount it on, on a trailer like this, which I've got at the moment, and I have had it mounted on the Land Cruiser as well uh, at different times. Now this, this uh, rooftop has been on this trailer, it's been all around outback Queensland, South Australia, Northern Territory and New South Wales. So it's done a lot of work, it's probably done over 20,000 kilometres uh, in its time on the road and uh, suffered a lot of dust and uh, rough roads and, and stones and all that sort of thing and it's, uh, it's handled it really, really well. Okay, so we're going to um, open it up for you now and show you how we go through the setup process. It's really quick and easy, only takes a few minutes. So we start with the restraining traps. And then we've got the, the Velcro ones. And it just pops up by itself on the gas struts. The next step is just to undo the retaining strap from the clip. I'm height challenged, so I need a little ladder to do this one. So this little uh, bungee strap, which holds everything in, can just be placed up in here for now out of the way. All right, now for the ladder. So just want to put the strap across and out of the way there. We undo the clip that holds us the ladder together. Okay, we're just going to undo the strap that retains the ladder. So pull the ladder out and fold the bed over. I'm just folding the ladder up again for now until we get it here. And for this one, we want to just unhook the ladder from the bottom steps, holding the top ones in place until we get it at the right height. So there. All right, now we can put the, uh, the awning supports in. I just keep them all inside the bed there so they don't get lost. Okay, pop the awning support into the provided hole. That's one. And the second one. And just make sure that the end here is in, in the right orientation so that you can then slot it into the hole in the awning up the top there. So that's the front done. And we go around this side and again we find the, we find the, the hole, pop that in there and then just bend this up, pop it in the hole on the awning. And the same with this side. And the same on the other side. That one as well. Okay. And I'll just usually just put that through up there. And that's pretty much it. I'm getting in. And the final tip is to secure these little Velcro straps here. It keeps everything nice and neat and tidy, one on each side. So uh, now for the pack down. Take the awning supports out. And we'll just pop them up in here out of the way. And just pop that down in there like that. Okay, next is to take these down. Awning supports on the side awnings. them. It's all very quick and easy to take down. And we'll pop these away as well. All right now for the ladder. And secure the ladder with the straps. And they can just hang there by, that, by itself, fine. Okay, right next we fold the bed frame in.
and it just falls down into place. Right, next step is to run the uh, little strap that holds everything in. Just gonna put that over the side here. And just clips up onto a little, little clip on the side there. And then I just pull the, pull the awnings in so it's all nice and neat. So when I, when I pull down the lid, it all folds in nice and easy. Same on this side, just watching out for that strap. Next is just a simple matter of folding it up with the strap. And it'll hold itself there and you just put the strap away into there. And then we just fold any loose bits in, push it all up in there. This one can go in here like this. Same on the other side. Use the Velcro straps to pull it down nice and tight. And then just the retaining straps just to hold it all in place. So that's it, nice and easy. I'm out of here.